bring the drama. She plays Genoa City's stunning department store heiress, Lauren Fenmore Baldwin, and he plays the conniving CEO of Jabot Cosmetics, Jack Abbott. From the hit CBS daytime drama, The Young and the Restless, please welcome Tracy Bregman and Peter Bergman. Gorgeous. Okay. You have to be gorgeous. Oh, yeah. so All right. So happy to be here with everybody. We're so happy to have you. 22 years, more than 22 years, YNR has been the number one daytime series. <laughs> Amazing. What do you guys attribute the success to, the long running success? You know, um, I think. As we've been growing up, I think our fans have been watching us and growing with us and and enjoying not only our stories on television but off camera. You know, they send us baby gifts when we have babies and, and weddings. And um, I, I just. My answer is slightly different. I've, I've been on the show for 22 years, and people ask me, so you've been the number one show for 22 years. To what do you attribute that? Uh, do the math. <laughs> oh, I see where we're going. And it didn't got, do so well yeah. before. No. I was going to say, you got to deal with this. You, got, no. you don't know Piz Morgan, do you? <laughs> yes. Yes. Same thing. And I love guy pole dancers. <laughs> now, Tracy, you've been in the business tw 28 years, right? But it Actually, it a little has, longer, but uh, yeah, we'll but it, for that. Okay. But um, it hasn't always been pretty. You, don't, you didn't always get to work with this. Kind of handsomeness, right? It's been hunks and rats, and I don't always rats. mean yes. I don't always mean the guys that I was working with. Oh. I was doing a storyline where my character was hallucinating, and uh, one of the things that I was hallucinating is my cell phone turned into a rat. Right. So we were going for the first take, and I guess we really hadn't rehearsed well. And I go to pick up the rat that was my cell phone, and I'm all drugged up, and I look and I turn it over, and I guess they forgot to order a female rat because ah, I've never ah. seen bigger balls in my entire life. There was no way I could finish the scene at all. <laughs> I'm rat sorry, balls. Julie. Oh, God. Can we say that? We, no. are, we are blazing new trails. <laughs> Now, Peter, I heard you may not have had that interesting of a job, but I heard you had some interesting jobs supporting yourself before you were... I had a were... bunch of interesting jobs in New York, kind of getting started when I was in, in acting school at the American Academy of Dramatic Arts. Um, I got a job uh, soliciting people in the Bronx to bother their neighbors for donations. I wasn't that successful. Um, uh, but while I was there, a janitor lost his job, and I got the... So I, before school, I did that. And then after school, I was a janitor there. And then uh, waiting tables in New York was a, a large part of my life. I was actually good at it, and I, and, and I liked it. I, 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 you know, yeah. There were other actors there who said, oh, God, i got to get out of here. Yeah. I thought there was something terribly wrong with me. I kind of liked it. <laughs> you know what? You paid your dues. We're going to have more with Peter and Tracy when we come right back. <laughs> With Tracy Bregman and Peter Bergman from The Young and the Restless. Now, Tracy, the Jabot Cosmetics Company has been, been a big part of The Young and the Restless storylines, but I understand now it's actually a real product line? Yes, yes. Actually, for 30 years, it's been a fictitious beauty brand, and now we're kind of taking it out of the television sets and into everybody's hands. And we have been so excited. We've been developing it for a long time, and I have to tell you, the products are cutting edge and fantastic. Look, do you use it? You bet. <laughs> We Don't want worry, it. Go back to your dressing rooms. It's all there. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Yeah. Holly and I, Holly and I, we did an appearance on your show. How did we do? I thought you were both very, very good. I, <laughs> I, I think there was a bit of ad libbing on your part that maybe got in the way. Well, we actually have a clip showing just how well Lee and I did. Watch this. <laughs> They're currently on a nationwide tour launching the new Jabot line after, after it's sapped. <laughs> <laughs> Told you I didn't need a rehearsal. 
We've got the goods. Jabot does not need a gimmick. You're a handsome bastard. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Chabot's got the goods. We don't need a gimmick. That's for damn sure with that face. <laughs> Want to make out? Let's do it. Are you wearing underwear? Yes, I'm wearing underwear. <laughs> Sorry, sir. I don't go commando on Yes, I'm wearing underwear, she said. <laughs> Sorry. You got the right seat for that shot, right? <laughs> Tight and lift and firm. Hell yeah. Can you put that on your ass? <laughs> Sorry. Right. Was that wrong? I tried. No. <laughs> <laughs> don't quit our day job. Right? I take so it great. that um, your fellow actors on YR don't normally do that kind of behavior that you saw from Lee and Holly, who okay. are two established actresses. I don't know if I'm... Exactly. I, 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 we expected so much more. It no. was Peter. It's Peter putting all that pretty blue-eyed stuff on him. <laughs> no, and I was silent for the first time ever. <laughs> you saw me. I just went, no, you just you didn't were make like, any ah, Do I speak? Uh -huh. Now, what? this Sorry. episode I heard airs July 28th, right, where we can July see 28th. you guys on The Young and the Rest. Oh, excited. Same day that Jabot launches on HSN. Oh, that's great. Please oh. watch. No, oh, Tracy. So, oh, sorry. No, 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 no. I'm just, I'm a little slow this morning. I'm slow <laughs> the uptake. I'm putting it all together. No, you're right. I don't know if people that was, explained it right. Okay, yeah. that was the blooper reel from, so your characters really go on the We talk. came on this show right. as our characters. We're so excited and, to come uh, for real. Yeah, it was terrific. Oh. oh, I see, I see. And then after your characters came on the talk on YNR, Chabot Cosmetics line is just going to exactly. go through the roof. The right. okay. Are you stealing jewelry? Are you stealing Tracy's jewelry? I mean, you know I'm always stealing. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm so, I designed this jewelry, so I'm so it's glad to gorgeous. have you have it. Take it. No. Don't give it to her. You just took it off my finger. Please take it. I would be so happy to have it. That's so sweet. I love that you, you stole that. Yeah. Let oh, me see what else you got on. <laughs> I like your dress, but I'm not that thin. Now, Tracy, I heard that you have two sons, 120, 114. Do you have any advice for raising boys? Oh, boy. Yeah, um, you know, I actually thought that uh, raising boys from the beginning would give me some insight in men, and I think I'm more confused than ever. <laughs> ever, I'm so confused. Uh, my, you know, thank you. My um, younger son, who's 14, called me so upset the other day because I had mixed the cereal. You oh, know? yeah. Mm, I guess that's the worst the thing you could do to a teen boy ever. is mix the cereal. Like two different ones? Really? I thought there was just at the end of one, and mm -hmm. I put the other, and he's calling me. How could you do that? And thank you. Yeah. <laughs> They're counting me in my ear. Oh, oh you want How to How could you do that? I know. I want to thank both of you. Oh, Tracy, sorry. Peter, you guys are <laughs> I'm big fans. Such a joy. Thank you for coming oh, on the show. Thank you. Thank you for coming. So you can catch the young and the restless week. CBS and don't miss Tracy with the Chabot line on HSN July 28th. Everyone in our audience is going home with an assortment. Log on to thetalk.com for a chance to win your own set and to learn more about Chabot. We'll be right back.